हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स आई एम अजय करमरकर बिफोर स्टार्टिंग फर्दर आई वुड लाइक टू से समथिंग प्लीज वॉच वीडियो कंप्लीटली एंड सीट विथ कॉपी पेन इफ यू फाइंड सम वेयर इंपॉर्टेंट देन प्लीज नोट इट एंड प्रोसीड फर्दर ऑल दो यू हैव फेसिंग एनी प्रॉब्लम आर डिफिकल्टीज प्लीज राइट इन कमेंट बॉक्स आई डेफिनेटली सॉल्व यूर प्रॉब्लम एंड अलॉन्ग विथ प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब बिकॉज that can reach more and more students okay thank you let's see what the question says here the question is multiple choice question maybe more than one what's the question says two non conducting solid spheres of radius r and two r having uniform volume charge densities rho 1 and uh, rho 2 respectively touch each other the net electric field at a distance to r from the center of the smaller sphere along the line joining the centers of the spheres is zero the ratio of rho 1 and rho 2 can be here you have given four options first option a is minus 4 option b minus 32 by 25 option c 32 by 25 and option d is 4 this question is asked j advance 2013 and paper first this question is totally conceptual and formula based question here we used the three formulas electric field at the outside of the charge body k q r square where r is uh, greater than capital r here inside k q small r r q here uh, this r is greater than uh, smaller than r and charge density as you know that here volumetric you have to given sphere so therefore you can use uh, charge density q by volume so this three formula we can use in this question what is given in this question you have given two spheres non conducting spheres they are keep in touch each other the radius of the smaller one is a uh, capital r and the radius a uh, bigger one is 2r And charge density is rho one and rho two respectively, and similarly charge q one and q two on the smaller and bigger. Here we have to find out net electric field. Net electric field is zero, but net electric field distance from the distance from the smaller one is two r always. So therefore, that may be two cases may be possible. If e is outside, r e is inside. How is e is inside? But distance is two r is always that is the fixed. Okay. so here it is r and this r total distance to r so therefore we have to take an electric field here this electric field is working for the out outside for the smaller one and this electric field working for the inside for the larger so here according to the question outside electric field for the smaller is equal to e electric field inside for the larger one and what is the formula we have used then you can see that k q 1 and distance is 2 r square here k q 2 and the distance is uh, here the r because small r in the place of small r the distance this is 2 r from the center and uh, similarly to r q remember for the inside here use r q then k k cancel q1 4 r square and q2 r and here 8 r q then uh, this 1 r and this r square and r square r square cancel out then q1 equal to 8 by 4 it is q2 4 to the 8 means q 2q1 equal to q2 so it is the condition first now charge can be written as 2 q can be written as charge density rho 1 and volume 4 by 3 pi and inner radius is r q and uh, rho 1 For the Q2, the radius should be taken to R 4 by 3 pi to R Q. Here 
4 by 3 pi, 4 by 3 pi cancel out. 2 rho 1 r cube, rho 2, here 8 r cube, r cube, r cube cancel, rho 1 and rho 2, 8 by 2, 2 1s are 2, 2 4s are 8, rho 1 and rho 2 is 4. So, in the given option, here D option is the correct. So, therefore, first option, rho 1 and rho 2 equal to 4. That is the correct answer. Now, we see second condition. In the case of second condition, net electric field is outside of both the spheres. So, here E1 plus E2 equal to 0. Then for the E1 is uh, 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught Q and uh, distance is 2R. It is given that plus 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught Q2 and what is the distance from this outside electric field that is 2R and this is R, 3R and 2R, total 5R distance. Look here, again, here is 2R, total distance from this 2R because 2R is the radius. This is R, total 3R and 2R distance is already given in the question. So, therefore, now it becomes 4R square. So, 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught, okay, in the place you can uh, put here K also. Uh, Q1 4R square equal to minus 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught Q2 25R square. 4 pi epsilon naught cancel out. R square R square cancel out. Q1 upon Q2 minus here 4 by 25. But you know that very well. Q1 and Q2. There is relation we have to already find out here. What is the charge? Charge can be written as rho 1 and 4 by 3 pi r q and this is rho 2 4 by 3 pi and the distance this is the radius is 2 r q equal to minus 4 by 25. This will be cancel out. And here rho 1 upon rho 2 r cube 8 r cube equal to minus 4 by 25 r cube r cube cancel. Then rho 1 upon rho 2 this 8 goes to the numerator of right side become minus 4 into 8 means 32 by 25. So now this answer is also correct rho 1 upon rho 2 equal to minus 32 by 25 means here the question given B option is correct. So, therefore, now B and D is the correct answer. I hope so you understand this question. Now, thank you for staying till the end of this video. And yes, I remind you again, don't forget to subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students and I will get the energy for making new videos. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.